guys on my swell. Just do it. What's good, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. And I know I look crazy, but that's because my hair looks crazy. And I really didn't feel like doing it all up before I get in the shower, so I just put on a hoodie. But as you can tell by the title, today I'm making a very big choice. Now, if you know me, I've been going on my hair since 10th grade. I'm now a freshman in college. And I'm not the type to really go and have short hair, but I think it's time because my hair is like really damaged. Not really, really damaged, but like damaged to the point where you can tell. And I felt like I should just start over, especially during the quarantine time. So it's like I have nothing to lose because nobody's going to see me if I don't like it. Also, it's April 10th. Last April 10th, I had my surgery and I'm just like, let me just make April 10th the day I just take risks and do stuff out of the blue. I just go wash my hair just so, you know, the curls can be fully developed so I know where to cut. What? But I'm about to just cut it right here. I'm going to set up a mirror and I'm going to do the big chop. Now, I know I'm probably going to cut off over four or five inches of my hair i just actually made a video of me straightening my hair so you can see how my hair was back then but i'll just do a little length check right now this is a little one it goes down to about right here it's definitely past shoulder length but we're just going to see and i'm really nervous so i know i'm going to be talking a lot and hopefully i don't look crazy so we're just going to see how this works out and keep watching okay so we're back from the shower hope you guys can see but like, i'm just looking in the mirror right here my skin is breaking out so bad like just please but um as you can see you can see where i need to cut like the back isn't as bad but like you can still see two different kind of textures if you look pretty close cut right there so i'm super nervous guys like i'm literally talking to myself before i even got on camera so first of all just gonna go all the way down here and just cut off like all this because yeah my mom's gonna be so mad but it's like i'm her daughter so like, she can't hate me that much so let's just go if i don't do it now i'm gonna be more bald longer while when we finally get to go outside so i might as well just First piece gone. Like I'm super extra, but like it needs to be done. So now we're just gonna start over here. It already looks healthier, like or am I tripping? So I'm not even about to try to be extra, like I'm about to just start cutting. Like you see where I need to cut. So we're just gonna do that. That's so short. I'm already regretting this. It looks healthier, but it's super freaking short. Take this. Look how healthy that looks, though. Like, her. It's not even really that short, to be honest. Like, it's just shrinkage. Actually, where it gets hard. Well, it's not really hard, but like. My front doesn't grow as fast, so it's going to be extra short up here. I cannot believe I'm cutting my hair right now. As you see. It looks so much healthier though, like. The fact that I'm doing this so fast, you can tell that I'm nervous. So like you see where I need to cut like it's like a little bush. I'm doing this right now 
Like, my parents are going to literally think I'm going through a midlife crisis. Because, like, me cutting my hair, it's never heard of. Oh, my gosh. I, I'm, try I'm really trying not to be one of them extra people that be doing the big job. But, like, I never thought this day would come. Like, I feel like it's worse than it looks because it's wet right now. But, like, I feel like when it's drenched, it will look better. Well, now that I'm past the little shy phase, I can just get to cutting. I think I got some of good hair. After I go through this, I am never putting heat on my hair again. Because I never want to have to do this again. Still some straight pieces. But it's okay. Like I said, like, look at this. Like, who wants that in their hair? I look so ugly in the camera. Like, I need edges. Let's see how this looks. I mean, it's not that short. Like, I could do a little ponytail. But yeah, like I said, the red hair probably won't stop. Because, like, when I dyed my hair red, like, it didn't really, like, it didn't get damaged at all. It's when I started straightening it for, like, graduation, prom, all these special events. When I started straightening my hair is when it started getting messed up. And sometimes I have to cut off, like, just p not perfectly good curls, but curls. But this is not my curl pattern. Like, if you look closely, like, that's not my curl pattern at all. I look so crazy right now, but I'm excited to see how it grows. Like, this side isn't as bad as the other side, which is why I was contemplating so long on cutting my hair. But it's just, like, do it now or you're going to get attached to it and it's just going to keep getting worse, you know? And I'm going to add in all these talking parts instead of just putting music over it because, like, I feel like you guys need to hear my talk through if you're thinking about cutting off your hair just freaking do it i can't even see why i need to cut it's not wet enough we're just gonna I think I can see. see this side isn't really that bad and i'll probably have to get it cut again like later down the line because i know i'm probably not even cutting that even I'm not leaving nothing, y'all. Like, nothing. <laughs> I look crazy. Oh my gosh. Now the pile is getting a little bigger on my head. See? It's not even red, though. Like, I'm gonna start doing smaller sections so I can have a little bit more even cut. I look like I'm from Jackson 5. But my hair is already thicker, like. But yeah, now I have a little afro. So let's see how long it is. It's this long. So I'm gonna do probably not monthly, but every so often updates. And just looking at some of these curls, like this is not my girl band. Like it's a cute curl, but it's not my girl band. And I'm supposed to get braids, but it's like. So yeah, I'm gonna go shower again and like wet my hair and see how the curls look and I'll be back on the camera. Okay, so this is how my hair is looking. It looks so much healthier, like I'm glad I did this. Even though some pieces 
are OC longer than the others. I love the scissors in them. I'm not my outfit, y'all. Okie dokie, I'm back. So, like, some pieces back here, I can't see. Like, I'm pretty sure I just need to be cut. This is the final result. This is how my curls look. Um, I'm about to put on... Oh, I don't have any. So I guess I am about to style it because I don't even have any leave-in conditioner. So I'm about to just style it and try to come back and show you guys. Okay, so we have good news, people. I can fit my hair in a low ponytail. Period. You know, it's borderline bald-headedness. I mean, I can look at this one because this uh, I need a scarf. I don't have a scarf. Like, I need a scarf to lay it down. Like, you know, really set it. Now, this is just a rough draft because I didn't want to use all my gel. Let me get closer for you guys. Like I said, I'm breaking out, so don't mind me. This is cute. It's a little ponytail, you know. It's not that bad, honestly. And to be honest, from the time when I got heat damage to now, it's been a year. So, technically, this is a year's worth of growth. Call it what you want, but I'm just going to say it how it is. But yeah, this is the final result. When it dries, I know it's going to get, like, flat. This is how it looks curls but yeah it's not really that bad like to be honest but if, if i was out i'll probably just wear it like this like do that oh my gosh brianna like your hair is not even cut oh yes it is boy now, like i said i probably won't stop dyeing my hair because i don't think i can but i'm definitely not ever putting heat in my hair again but if i don't get to do the second part to this video leave any video requests that you have down below because now that i have shorter hair like i can do more videos like on how I style it. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn your post notifications. See you guys next video. So guys, I went to go make some mac and cheese and I took out my ponytail. Y'all look, look how healthy my hair looks. Like, I actually have curls and I have shrinkage. Like as you can see from my before picture, right there. And then now look at this. Like if you're thinking about cutting your hair, just cut it. Like. And even my hair this length can still fit in the ponytail, like, y'all, just look at how healthy it is. And it still goes to right here. But yeah, I just want to show you guys that. Oh, still make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and turn on push notifications.